Good morning, everyone. I'm a mess. I'm a hot mess right now, but that's okay because it's morning and I don't plan to go out today. Um, I have a couple of videos to record uh, because I want to give uh, as much attention as I can to the videos that I'm going to record. You guys will see why later. Um, but before I did that, I wanted to come on and um, talk a little bit. <laughs> I guess you could say I'm my hair. Um, anyway, um, four months ago, when I started my channel, I simply started it to have something to do. As some of you guys may or may not know, I am disabled. And um, even though I've attempted to work several times, it's failed, unfortunately. Um, nine years ago, nine and a half years ago, uh, a brain tumor was discovered. And um, though it wasn't um, cancerous, it was uh, very crucial to have it removed. Uh, consequences to this brain tumor, if not found on time, would have been what doctors uh, call gigantism. Meaning, I would have swollen up, I would have looked hideous. My eyes would have bulged out and um, my hands would have been extra large and I'm only 5'4 so um it was discovered due to the fact that um I was swelling up for no reason I thought it was my blood pressure but and before discovery a I was fired I was a dental assistant and I was fired from my job because according to the head dentist because guys to this day I don't remember this happening but according to the head dentist I refused to take x-rays for one of the dentists that I was assisting. I don't remember that happening, but then um, after being fired and depressed and stuff, you know, I started bruising easily. A lot of medical reasons, a lot of medical things that started happening. So I, I, I as always, I go automatically go to the um, doctors whenever something different is going on with me because of my medical history. So after running several tests, CAT scans, MRIs, brain scans, they found the tumor. And I'm sorry, my hair is really bothering me. So um, the tumor was removed successfully. Um, but due to the tumor, um, my multitasking skills um, got affected by it. I've tried to go to work several times, like I said, but always fail at it. That's why when you see me doing my videos and I say I'm going to do this, I tend to forget. <laughs> it's not, it's, it's part of life, but it's also part of the um, consequences. But anyway, uh, when I started my YouTube channel, like I said, four months ago, it was solely to have something to do because I'm home all day, every day. And it can be depressing. Um, some of you, very few of you actually, um, know what I've been through. Uh, my year started very rough. Two weeks into the year, our family was affected uh, very, very bad. Um, and I fell into depression. And, but with prayer and faith, um, things are, things have been getting better. But it was tough. It was a tough start of the year. And even though it is getting better, we're still going through it. And, you know, with, with faith in God, everything will work out. But my channel was started once again because I wanted something to do. Um, I would watch YouTube. I've been watching YouTube for a long time. Got really dedicated to it uh, just uh, this year because... I got off of social media, I got off of Facebook, and um, I wanted something to do. So I started watching YouTube, and I started um, getting ideas on how to budget better, and started finding out where the clearance events were, and um, entering giveaways, you know, all that. I would do my hauls and then send pictures to my kids and say, hey, look what I found. And they would be excited. So hubby says to me, Ma, he calls me Ma. He says, Ma, why don't you just start your own channel? You enjoy what you're watching. Why don't you do it yourself? So I did. So back in uh, four months ago, can't think right now as to when four months ago was, I started my channel not knowing that I was going to meet so many awesome people, have so much support, love, respect, everything. I've met some tremendous people. And I just wanted to do this video really quick, all that rambling, just to say this. <laughs> I appreciate you guys. Um, my videos that are coming up are surprise friend mail. 
something that I was not expecting at all. And um, that means a lot because I didn't come on here to, in the hopes of anything happening other than me having something to do. But the outcome, the pouring of love and support and communication, I can distract my mind from what's going on in my life. And I have you guys to thank for that. And um, I appreciate you guys. It's just as simple as that. <laughs> so I just wanted to let you guys know that I love you guys. I appreciate you guys, every single one of you. Um, the ones that I've communicated on a personal level, whether it be through email, text messages, phone calls. Thank you. I hope to for that to continue and meet more people at whatever level you're comfortable at. So I just wanted to say thank you guys. There are two more videos coming up after this one because um, I received two packages <laughs> and two cards. So I'm going to do a package and a card in each video because I want to, I don't want to crunch it all in one video. So I'm going to do it that way. So keep an eye out, guys. Talk to you in a few. Love you guys. Bye.